Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a whole house ultimate clean with me video. I basically clean my whole house for over six hours so you should be able to find tons of cleaning motivation throughout this video. For those of you that are new to my channel, hello my name is Abby. I do a lot of cleaning, organizing, grocery hauls, decluttering videos, just motherhood, lifestyle, all jam packed into one. I definitely give you the real deal messy side of life on my channel. Thank you so much for joining in today and watching. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. So first today, as you can see, I'm starting off in my kitchen, which is normally where I always like to start. It's normally one of the messiest rooms in my house and I find that if I start there, it gets me motivated to do the rest of my house. When I clean my kitchen, I like to start off by cleaning off my countertops, just completely getting everything that's on them put away or thrown away wherever it needs to go, and then moving on to my dishes. At this moment, my dishwasher is actually broken. So I get the lovely task of doing all of my dishes by hand, which isn't that bad. It could be, definitely be a lot worse. It just takes a little bit more time. One thing I always like to do after doing my dishes is clean out my sink. Today I'm just using a little bit of dish soap in my sponge, but sometimes I will also use like Comet or some type of like scrub in here as well. But today I just have a dish soap on hand, so that's what I'm using today. Yeah, he's calling all his friends to get some action and distract him right now. He's fine, but Lucy on the line, let's get this started. Where's the party tonight? I feel good, nothing weighs me down. I can't believe now that my sink is all cleaned out i get to go in and clean all of my countertops i'm just going in with a multi-surface cleaner it's a mrs myers it's actually in the bluebell scent which is one of my favorites The dining room actually is not too bad. I just have a few random things on the table and then I can wipe it all down and be done. Another day she would have wished to stay, but they're done. Red eyes while he's 
As I am filling up this bowl with my apples, it reminds me that I have a Costco haul on my channel as well. So if that's something that you guys are interested in, be sure to go check that out. I have everything that I got from Costco on there and it was a very big haul. But big bummer with these apples, they were actually all bad. I've never had that happen to me from Costco before, but they were just mushy and brown on the inside. They could not save one of them. It's never happened. I normally have such good luck with Costco produce, but unfortunately this time, I guess I just caught a bad batch. But anyways, if the Costco haul is something that you're interested in. Be sure to go check that out after you're done watching this video. Future like that, it hurts. So giving something worse to pass the time. Jumping back in the kitchen for a quick second so I can wipe down my island and clean my oven. This oven, the vent in the middle does not work. When I turn it on, it just sucks all the heat from the burners so I can't actually have that vent on as I'm cooking. But the other downside to it is that food always seems to get stuck down in here and it is pretty dirty. So I'm gonna go ahead and start to vacuum that out. I'm feeling trapped down on the floor I don't know what for Feels like I'm gonna lose Silence takes a hold I can't let it go Chain up, no one knows But I won't let the stormy seas Throw me an open water Let me have my peace And leave me till tomorrow Wind into my sail Away from things I let go Floating on the waves We go bottoms up We go all the way When you're feeling down so this is actually just the entryway area of my house, as you can probably tell by the front door. But this kind of becomes a catch-all. There's just shoes everywhere. Everything just gets kind of placed here from when people come in the front door. So I'm gonna get everything put back to where it needs to go. On to the living room, which actually isn't too bad. I just need to put down the sofa cushions and fix like the blankets and the pillows and a few other random things. We do put the sofa cushions up at night because we don't want our dog to get on the sofa. So I have to put those down every morning or whenever I get around to it. But I'm gonna put the sofa cushions down, get the blankets and the pillows fixed up, and then I'll be moving on to the computer cabinet, which you'll see in a minute. And it is a complete disaster. So this computer cabinet definitely needed a good organizing and wipe down. It was very dusty and very dirty. I'd been putting it off for far too long. I've just been kind of throwing stuff in, shutting the doors and pretending like it's not there because no one else could see it either. So no one even knew it was dirty, but I did. So it'd been weighing on for me for a little bit. So I decided today would be a great day to do it. So hopefully you guys enjoy the transformation.
regrets Girl, put your faith in me Even though we just met Let's forget about our curfew Cause all that is stuck in my head It's me and you Hope, speed, and my heart is racing But I'm not sure I wanna face it Cause it only does this with you Our bodies meet, I can feel the tension Move us into the next dimension Let's just let our bodies be true I'm going to finish dusting in my living room and then move on to vacuuming, which is something I save for the very end. Once I'm done cleaning the whole main area of my house, I always go in and vacuum that whole main area all at once instead of going room by room. I just find it easier to do it at the very end altogether. Now on to mopping my whole entire main area of my house. I'm using a little bit of Mr. Clean floor cleaner. It's honestly not my favorite. It leaves my floors just a little streaky. Just It just doesn't clean them as well as other things have, I guess I should say. But I do wanna get through the cleaner that I do have. I don't want it to go to waste, so I'm gonna use that today. It does smell very good, I will say that, and I think it may have more to do with the, my type of flooring more than the cleaner. I feel like if it was on a different flooring, it would work a lot better. It's hard for me to find cleaners that work well and don't streak the flooring that I have. It's like a luxury vinyl tile, I believe is what it's called. I love the way it looks, but the cleaning part of it, it's been a journey for me to find one that really works, but I think the Mrs. Myers, just the multi-surface cleaner, that works really well. Just a vinegar and water works really well. And then Bona also has a laminate flooring cleaner that I also love as well. So those are like my top three that I will use. Man, that water was dirty, but moving on into the bathroom, 
it is a pretty big mess in here. I know my bathtub looks disgusting, but to be honest, I used self tanner and then I took a bath and it left a ring on the tub. So that's just from one bath and that I did not clean it this morning after I took it. So I'm getting to that now. So first off, I'm going to take everything out of the tub and then just go in with my Kaboom cleaner and wipe it all down. off the bathroom i'm going to clean the floors i don't know how i left this out earlier but the method in the almond scent is definitely one of my favorite floor cleaners as well which is what i'm using in here i love the scent of it and it does really well on this marble and the tile in my master bathroom as well once again that mr clean cleaner doesn't do very well on any of the flooring in my house so maybe it's not that great i would definitely just skip over buying that one it's probably not worth it but the method one, I don't know how I left that out. That is definitely my number one. Do you ever walk into a room that's so messy you don't even know where to start? Because that is where I am at this moment. This is my six-year-old daughter's room. She had a sleepover, as you can tell. They had a lot of fun and made a big mess. So normally she would be helping me clean up, but sometimes if it's super messy, I just go in there. It's easier for me to get everything put back where it's supposed to go. And it just helps her in the long run be, be able to find everything that she needs to find. So today I'm in here cleaning it by myself. I was cleaning in here I did realize how much I need to go through and just give her room a big clean out get rid of stuff organize just kind of take everything dump it in the middle of the floor and go through it along with her closet I definitely I actually kind of want to do this to every room in my house just go through deep clean declutter organize everywhere in my house one by one so if that's something that you guys are interested in be sure to let me know because I would love to film my house room by room decluttering and organizing so let me know if that's something that you guys would be interested in
changes Come pick me up cause I just wanna see the light I wanna be weightless Teach me to fly, I won't be coming down Could somebody wake me up? I don't wanna be here and let the world pass me by yeah. I just see her face where So sick of waiting and getting too restless to be in this dusty town. I've heard of this place where people forget and you get another try. So come open up my door. I don't wanna be here and let the world pass me by. I won't see your face. I'm feeling happy And moments ago I was only empty What did you slip me? My heart is racing and I'm getting dizzy There must be something complicated after I fact of this Will I wake up in your bed and regret everything I did Like a hangover but leave me needing one more fix She said, shut your mouth and kiss me Hey, don't waste your breath Cause you know what I'm feeling Midnight's closing in And I won't wait for you Don't think about it twice We're way back second What feels like an eternity later I am finally done in that bedroom And now I can move on to my own Which actually isn't that messy It generally doesn't get too messy in here Just clothes, you know, the normal stuff So I'm going to kind of go through Put clothes, shoes away And then vacuum, dust, and make my bed just how we met There must be some complicated after effect to this Will I wake up in your bed and regret everything I did Like a hangover but leave me needing one more fix She said, shut your mouth and kiss me Hey, don't waste your breath Cause you know what I'm feeling Midnight's closing in and I won't wait for you Don't think about it twice We're way past second guessing And I want you now yeah, shut your mouth and kiss me In the parking lot, in the backseat Don't dare to stop now Just close your eyes and kiss me Like you mean it, you're a bad dream But I'm into it now Yeah, shut your mouth and Don't think about it twice 
reason Yeah, I'll just close my eyes and kiss you Like I'm leaning, you're a bad dream But I'm into it now Yeah, I'll just close my eyes and kiss you And look at all that dust. That is so much. So I'm glad to have that up off my floors. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. It was definitely a fun one to make and it definitely felt so good to get my house all nice and clean. So I'm gonna leave you with some good before and afters so you guys can enjoy the transformations. But once again, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. Take care and I will see you guys in the next one. You said that you needed me Like a cargo